Hello, are you there? Hello, Master 1.68 million. Looking up to U9, the long welcome home. So, is it the best mass-produced supercar in China, or does it look like a 321 sports car? The design of the time gate does not imitate anyone. It's about looking at your own aesthetic. Of course you don't have to like it. But what you can't ignore is that you can see his presence at any time. Do you guys think that we like supercars a lot of the time? Not just because of its performance, and because of its shape. It blows up the street. From this point of view, it's been a long time. So technically, every line that we see here takes into account the task of pressure braking at wind resistance. 12 active and passive air repair kits. Carbofibrinol provides downforce, direct clean airflow to the braking area. Special groups clean the airflow to form a low pressure area outside the wheel. The whole braking zone blows and sucks. Double our heat dissipation. This car comes with an all carbon fiber swan necktail. It's got this alien arched foot that's constantly changing laterally. It can better adapt to the airflow coming from the roof of the car, with this diffuser, the maximum is to provide 300 kilograms of downforce to kill the car on the track. Is this double click to open and close the door the only one? What I do know is that if you know anyone else who can do this, you are welcome to post it in the comments. The supercar is called the master of the wind. The wind is coming. I am walking in the wind. It's so low, this car, his door is not just going up. He actually has an outward angle. So there's actually no way we can get to the door like this. It has a close button in this position, which is very convenient. So it's the door. The three positions of the central control in the car can be closed. I think the whole interior of this car is still very strong. The style of the GT sports car is still very luxurious and comfortable. Especially this seat, it feels quite comfortable to sit on it. And this seat has ventilation, heating, and massage. Can you stand it? And he has an electric brace. The whole time I was driving the track, every time I made a sharp bend, he would give me a support. He can adjust this strong, medium, and weak third gear. The start button is here. The red one still has a sense of ritual in super running. And then after opening it, there is actually a screen in the middle. This is the knob to adjust the driving mode. In addition to the modes we normally think of as a supercar, it also has a snow mode. After all, are we a different square platform? Just four motors to control each wheel individually. So to be honest, the car also has a bad gap from the ground. He's got to be a pretty good off-road vehicle too, if he has some clearance. Then don't you look up to Yuba? And then when we go to race mode, it's a lot more like drifting, what track sharing, etc. A lot of fun content. In addition, look, after you order this car, you can control each of his doors individually. Open and then include our trunk, open. This is something that no other supercar can possibly have, right? Stop. Let's take off our high heels and put them here. There's a storage space here. Sister will take you for a ride, but you have to sit tight and hold on because the zero to 100 kilometer acceleration of this car is only 2.36 seconds. We are now in Jujo International Racing. When I actually ran this track just now, I was fully immersed and I didn't have any spare time to talk to you with a helmet on. Because the horsepower of this car is just too much. This E4 Square has four motor controls. Everyone is very familiar with it. So the maximum horsepower that makes this long-standing machine is 1,300 horses. Peak torque is dry to 1,680 nanometer. A thousand horsepower car. Can you still say it is like a supercar? It is a supercar at all? The body structure of this car is made of carbon fiber. It's like using 110 kilograms of monocoque carbon pods. But the Taiwan has a long hole mass because it is a pure electric car. So it still reached about 2.5 tons. And the feeling of a pure electric sports car running on this track is completely different from a gasoline sports car fuel car if we throw away the oil. In fact, you can immediately feel that there is a significant decrease in its power. But this car, when you drop the switch, if you don't drive to any power recovery, his whole linearity is still going for you all the time. You feel like you've lost the store, but he didn't lose speed at all. Now this car is completely silent, right? It's completely silent. Then we can turn on this sound mode for him. I'm putting it on the wall right now. Let's step on it. He has no sound of tempering. It should be better if he adds some tempering. His speeding voice. Oh, wow. Oh, there is. What do you think of that?
that sound? Then I'm actually in a normal open state now. And I'm driving pretty slowly. It's like slipping down the street on the track. Just now on the track. If you unscrew it, you will obviously feel the help of its cloud points, this body stabilization system. I think it is beyond my imagination because I thought the car was quite heavy and had a lot of horsepower. At the beginning of the corner, I still felt that I didn't have any confidence. To be conservative, what I found was that he had a very good will to roll the car throughout our corners. So first of all, we did a test of ejection starting and emergency braking. In this process, the Cloud Inspection X has very good control over the maintenance of his car body. Right before we even started talking, that was when we slammed this brake to the bottom. And then when you press the accelerator to the bottom, the car runs like a run-up. Just come out. Right, 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 right. Like. The sprinter, you just lay there, you dive down, and then you're gone. When we throw away our brakes... Wow, wow. Okay, the coach is already called out. Let's just say you can imagine how fast. Therefore, Yuanja's system controls the horizontal and vertical aspects of the entire body very well. And the most amazing thing is that he not only controls the state of the entire body, and he's holding us back from rolling, and he's allowing the tires to gain a little bit of traction on the ground. So you feel like this car is just locked in the corner and locked in the center of the corner. If you hurry up, then I dare not say it, because I am at this level. I can only say that this car is at my level. His performance is very stable. The limits of this car, I definitely can't drive. And let's just say you don't test the limits of this car. He's absolutely terrifying. He's going at a top speed of 309 kilometers per hour. Looking up at a long time, there is a construction vehicle. They are always improving have been going to advance there extremely fast. So far, they've measured the pole of this construction vehicle has reached 375 kilometers per hour, and they're still laying. So it is just around the corner that the car behind may break 400 kilometers per hour. It has to be said that BYD has indeed made efforts in engineering research and development and technology. Look up or not. In fact, we dare not say because it may be too early, but at least let the world hold their heads up first. Take a look at our Chinese cars. just a few years? Let's take a look at the current Chinese auto market. I don't think any foreign automaker can understand how we got to where we are in such a short time. So this one looks up to a long time. Doesn't it look good? Does it matter whether it sells well or not? He's doing laps at the Nürburgring, seen by the world at Goodwood. Doesn't that mean anything? Doesn't it mean anything? Open the door of time and space. You have returned to the original era of China's new energy vehicle market. There is a strong speculative atmosphere under the current fiscal subsidy. We don't build cars. We are subsidizing. At that time, the growth of the new energy vehicle market was almost stagnant. The market urgently needs a reshuffle. This is where Tesla comes in. Inspired our wolf nature. Chinese automakers are getting serious about building cars. We have also officially entered the era of private consumption in the new energy vehicle market. This brand is called Looking Up. I don't think he wants others to look up to him. He wants to remind himself to always look up, looking up at the stars in the universe. Hope in the mire, the dream of Chinese cars. Thank you for watching this call together. I am Joant. See you next time.